Yeah, Rick and Karina, as you said, this has turned tragic. We now know that one person has died as a result of what officials are calling a mass casualty incident in both the 10, uh, excuse me, the westbound and eastbound lanes of the 10 freeway are affected right now. Take a look right behind me. You can see just how much traffic there is, especially closer to us on the westbound side. Lots of congestion. Traffic is crawling right now. And then on the eastbound side, we were stuck in that traffic as well. Some cars are slowly being let through, but off into the distance, you can see lots of those police cars out there as well as emergency crews. Now let's take a look at some of the video we've got from earlier. Officials say the initial call came in at around 8 09 involving five to six vehicles on the westbound side. Moments later, another 911 caller reporting an accident on the eastbound side, initially saying there were about 16 vehicles in that incident. But what we have learned is that was three to four vehicles on the eastbound side and again uh, about five to six on the westbound side. In total, 10 vehicles involved in this incident. Now, I spoke to the San Bernardino County Fire Department spokesman and he says that they have several patients in need of help and they did earlier on. Also, according to that report, there was one person who was reported to be unresponsive and trapped in their vehicle. Ultimately, three people were transported to local hospitals, one with life-threatening injuries, two with non-life-threatening injuries, and again, one person has died. Now, earlier today, when we arrived here, we did speak to one woman who says, you know, it's been a problem for quite some time now, the last two to three years out here. Uh, we still, of course, don't know the cause of this accident or this, you know, really tragic incident with so many cars involved, but she says, it's gotten so bad just because of the construction out here. Take a listen. What are some of the challenges with driving down this freeway, this part of 10th ramps? It's the off ramps. You don't know if it's an off ramp or is it a construction site or you don't know. And they change it all the time. Would you say it's more difficult to travel through here dangerous. because of the construction? It's very dangerous. It's very dangerous for, the, for driving and walking and on a bike. And again, you are seeing a live look at the 10 freeway westbound and eastbound lanes. Lots of emergency crews out there, but traffic is crawling for anybody who is planning on moving through this area. Be prepared for delays because of that 10 car incident. Uh, and I did also ask the San Bernardino County fire spokesperson. I said, you know, if it is involved on the east and westbound lanes, are they both? Did something kind of cross over into the other lane? He says that's a good question. They don't know just yet. The CHP is the investigating agency, but we are going to be reaching out to them as well to get the latest information. But again, one person has died and three others have been taken to hospitals, one in critical condition. That's the very latest here from Upland. I'm Shelby Nelson, KTLA 5 News. Yeah, just a huge mess there tonight. Shelby, thank you.